Hello gamers, I am Mike DeZorch and I have three major announcements today. The first one I want to make is on July 4th, I am hosting a live stream on Gamers Bay and that live stream will simulcast to my new streaming channel on Kick. Uh, I'm no longer streaming to Twitch. I haven't been in a long time, but uh, I have moved uh, my flag to Kick and so I will be streaming there whenever I do live stream and um, I'll be simulcasting the Gamers Bay July 4th Frag Fest playing Hell Let Loose. It's an event I started last year for uh, July 4th for the Gamers Bay community and I'll be hosting it again this year starting at 2 p.m. Central. So if you want to uh, come watch on YouTube or my kick channel the links will be in the video description below uh, second major announcement and this is one I have to make before the last announcement because the last because the last announcement is going to have a major impact on everything moving forward the second major announcement is I'm renewing my commitment to helping out gamers Bay the owner is a close friend of mine he wants me to focus on doing more stuff for Gamers Bay, and I understand where he's coming from. Of our two channels, his is the only one that's still monetized, because after the change in the rules from um, what which channels can be monetized, you know, what's the requirement to be a monetizable channel. My channel used to be monetized. YouTube changed the rules some time ago. They've been changing them ever since again and so i'm still not monetizable on my channel and um uh, so we've been working on improving things over on gamers bay and getting more revenue up there uh so i will be taking time out on mondays to produce uh, multiple videos for Gamers Bay. I won't be releasing them all on the same day. I'll be trying to do at least two to three Retro Spotlights. That's the, that's the videos that I've been doing. Now, Retro Spotlight is a video series where I will play a little bit of a retro game. Uh, either arcade or something from Atari 2600, Commodore 64, ZX Spectrum, Amiga. Uh, I have access to a ton of retro games. And so I'll I have, I have no, um, I have, I, 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 I have no, um, um, no problem having material. The purpose of the Retro Spotlight is to get people interested in those games. Rather than being a full, full playthrough, they just get people interested in them. And that's the purpose. I've also uh, been toying with a new uh, format for the show. If you watched Boogie Wings, that was the first video uh, where I have the new format, where I have the new graphics on screen and everything uh, for for the show. Uh, then I did another one on Ultimate um, Ghosts and Goblins. That's also in the new format. So again, renewing my commitment to helping Gamers Bay because he's a friend of mine. He wants me to focus a lot on helping Gamers Bay build up the channel. And um, I'm going to be doing that. I'm going to be helping him out. Producing more videos for his for his channel. Um, they, they're they not doing... Um, Retro Spotlight videos are, is, is not as labor intensive as doing like say my videos like the Into the Radius stuff my my into the radius videos are a little more labor intensive than the gamers based stuff so i can i could easily pump out two or three in a day um for that the only diff only thing is is that it takes time to render with adobe with not adobe with um davinci resolve that's what i use uh and so i'm helping him out what i'm doing with my next announcement does not change anything for gamers bay if anything i'm doing more for gamers bay than i have have ever done 
before. On to my final announcement, and this this decision is final. I am moving to Rumble. That will not mean that I'm not going to produce videos on YouTube. Um, my home base is going to be Rumble. In fact, it already is. As of Wednesday of last week, I have moved all the videos that I want to move for Resort Central. All the videos that I want to move for Resort Central, I have moved to Rumble. In fact, that's all the Into the Radius videos. I'm not going to be moving any of the other stuff that I've done. Um, those are going to stay here. The Rumble channel is going to be focusing on the Professor Adventures, a new show called Zorch, which I will be producing once a week, and, um, and some other stuff, primarily focusing on VR and MMOs, and a lot of VTuber stuff um, that I will be doing as, you know, my digital persona of myself, and also as the professor. That will be the focus on Rumble. Uh, I also will be doing some more stuff on Kick. Uh, any live streams that I do for Gamers Bay will also be simulcast to my channel on Kick, just like the July 4th video that I'm doing for them in a couple of days. But um, things have happened here that have forced me to make this decision. I, I understand that you know, my friend over at Gamers Bay wants me to focus on Gamers Bay, build up the channel, and then, you know, get get the money for Gamers Bay built up, get the revenue built up for Gamers Bay first, then work on my channel. But things have been happening here that have made that just not viable. Um, again, he's my friend. I'm going to stay committed to helping Gamers Bay producing more videos for him tomorrow i'm going to be producing at least up to two videos or more if i can squeeze in the time um to to do that but i need to do what i need to do several things have happened one um this place needs repairs the people we bought it from the 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 previous owners of this trailer park when they put this place together um when they when they repaired this place, they repaired it before we moved in. They used the cheapest, the the cheapest, most awfulest parts they could find, and it's now it's falling apart because they used the cheapest crap. The floors, you get a drop of water on the floors, it crumbles to dust, literally, and that's that's happening in a couple of places, and. It's, it's the, the cheap shit they put into this place. And they said they repaired it, they replaced the floors, they used the cheapest shit they could find. And it, it is, we need to do repairs, but we don't have the money to do it. Or if we do do it, it's going to make things super tight here. And they're already super tight because we had to get another vehicle. See, Tiger and I, we are disabled. We we can't drive. We have poor vision. We can't get a driver's license. And holding a job out here, we're in the boonies. There's no way we could get a job out here. I mean, the only thing that I'm good at is tech support, and that's dime a dozen nowadays. I mean, most companies outsource that crap to, to um, China or India, where it's cheaper. Being a tech support guy used to mean something. Doesn't anymore. It, it doesn't mean crap anymore. Having an A plus certification used to mean something. Doesn't anymore. Hasn't meant anything in a long time. And that's what he and I, that's what Tiger and I have been good at. You know, he's he's been a programmer, but he's been he was an ALC programmer. Besides the government agency he worked for, who else uses ALC? Who else uses Assembler? Except maybe some um, 
maybe some uh, Linux developers. Which probably wouldn't be able to pay them much. I mean, but he does have some things that he's working on to try and bring in some more money to, to our group. And what I'm going to be doing with Rumble and Kick is going towards bringing in some more stuff. Um, I'm also something, I'm also pretty good at writing. I'm going to be writing some short stories and publishing them on uh, Kindle to try and bring in a little bit of, trying to bring in a little bit of stuff. I've been looking at Teespring, um, possibly doing some uh, t-shirt designs, some slogans and things like that, uh, possibly to bring in some stuff. I know Gamerspace has been looking at building a store because uh, you can have links at the bottom um, below the video to store links on YouTube. He's been wanting to do that. Um, but that costs money, money which he currently doesn't have. That's why I'm doubling my commitment to Gamers Bay to produce more videos for his channel. Which is why, you know, what I'm going to be doing for Zot Central is not going to impact what I'm going to be doing for uh, Gamers Bay at all. I need him to understand that uh, so that he doesn't, um, you know, it, it doesn't panic. I mean, I like the guy. He has been a good friend for a while, and I don't, I don't screw over my friends, and I don't want to, I don't want to leave him in the lurch. Uh, I want to help him, and so that's why I'm going to be committed to doing more videos for him and his channel even though i am no longer making youtube my focus and i'll be doing more for my channel although i know he wanted he wanted me to to focus more on his channel for now and then build up my channel later after we built up gamers bay more but i just can't do that now things have changed things have gotten be bad here not not uh, untenable but I need to do this before it gets really really bad um, for us here I mean, we still have time to do something before we start having to turn things off uh, over here um, we pay a ton for our ISP and we're unlim unlimited Thing, the thing is, we're grandfathered in. If we turn that off, we're not getting that back. Um, our other option would be to maybe go with the T-Mobile wireless, which is unlimited, but um, it's in the air, you know, how good our reception will be. There's Starlink, but we don't have a clear enough uh, view of the sky for it and that's um while well, that's a good service um there are times when it may not be may not work and i can stream with that you can stream with starlink you are capable of doing that but um if we have to turn it off um we'll be we'll have our, our internet will be more limited and that's one of the higher bills that we have here we're already looking at we're one of the things that we're doing to try and reduce some of our costs here is that we are shutting things down at night um, when we go to bed we're turning things off shutting things down to try and bring down the electric bill or during the day like uh, turning off the air conditioning to make it warmer at night and um, just have our fans on while we're sleeping to keep us cool at night um, You know, we've been doing stuff like that. And again, Tiger's working on some stuff that will help us bring in some more money. And my stuff with doing things with Rumble and Kick and a couple other ideas, like maybe doing some Kindle book, maybe some, doing some short sci-fi short stories, uh, sci-fi and fantasy short stories on um, Kindle releasing some of those, taking a couple of days to write some stuff like that and um, produce some stuff 
and releasing it on Kindle because you can you can self-publish uh, on the Kindle through Amazon. Um, looking at uh, possibly doing some tea, stuff with Teespring, maybe. Uh, just a number of things. And the w one thing I really don't want to do, I hate having to do this because I had my, my, my ex made me do it years ago. And I was really bad with depression. I was laid off. She made me go out and beg for money. And it was for the kids and also for her. She smoked. And so it was out to get money for her smokes and money for the kids. And she made me go out and beg for, beg for money. And I really hated having to do that. And I, my, my, my depression was worse then, and she really didn't give me much in the way of moral support at all. Uh, didn't really understand what was happening to me at that time, but I, that was, that's water under the bridge. She passed away a few years ago. We were good friends um, after all that, after uh, we broke up and everything, we were, we, we were good friends. Uh, when she passed away um so that that's all water on the bridge but I, I i don't like asking for help and um it might come to me just asking people to donate what they can um i mean i've got paypal um I might open a Patreon or Subscribestar if my channel on Rumble builds up uh, more uh, more followers. Might possibly look into doing that. But um, and I know that people don't like it when videos talk about money stuff and things. I've I've heard that uh, people don't like that. Anyway, um, that's the announcements that I needed to make. Uh, so let me recap. July 4th, doing a live stream for Gamers Bay, simulcasting on my Kick channel. Links are in the description below for that. Check it out, please. I'll be playing the massively online uh, FPS, World War II FPS, Hell Let Loose, for the July 4th celebration at um, Gamers Bay. Uh, second announcement, I'm renewing my commitment to helping out Gamers Bay, producing more videos a week for them, um, more retro spotlight stuff, possibly some new things. I'm looking at some options of what other new stuff I could be doing for them. But right now it will be more retro spotlight. I have no, um, I have, I have no shortage of games that I can play. I've got access to thousands of retro titles that I can cover tons of them and so I have, I have no shortage of stuff that I can show in retro spotlight and the third announcement is that I have already moved my flag to rumble I'm already there uh, YouTube will get videos after the fact after they appeared on rumble first in fact, the first video, first of the new um, the Professor Adventures videos, I will be producing one very soon, and that will be up on Rumble. In fact, uh, by the time you see this, it'll probably already be there, or I'm already working on it. Mondays, as I said, will be my Gamers Bay days, where I will be producing stuff for Gamers Bay all day, or as, as, as much time as I can squeeze in to produce stuff for gamers bay producing at least two a day two a week maybe three uh they're not as complex a video to produce as stuff for or central is because of all the vr stuff that i have to do and a lot of some of the editing that i have to do for the videos occasionally they're not as complex to produce but um those are my three big announcements and 
that's the way things are going to be start come moving forward um nothing of what i'm doing i'm going to reiterate this again nothing of what i'm doing with resort central is going to change my commitment to gamers bay in any way in fact my commitment to gamers bay is only going to get bigger i'm going to be producing more content but i'm also going to be doing more stuff for resort central and my primary focus is going to be on rumble those are my announcements so um the link to my rumble channel is in the description below i encourage you if you follow me here uh go there and and follow me there subscribe to me there and uh watch for future videos from into the radius um the other shows i'm going to be producing there for my channel will also be there um i am looking at possibly live streaming there um if i can do it there are some things that i'm i'm some subscriptions i've got that i'm going to be turning off so that i can get a restream subscription so that i can use uh custom server custom servers you need that in order you need a subscription to do a custom server custom on uh, to stream stream to a custom url with restream so i can stream to uh rumble and kick simultaneously whenever i do any live streams but um those are the announcements uh thanks for watching i've been mike the zorch and um yeah uh this it will be the last new made specifically for youtube video that i'm going to be uh uploading all other stuff is going to be on rumble but again i'm not completely leaving youtube anything i post on on rumble is going to come here i'm going to post post that stuff here but my home for now on is rumble and this is final. Thanks for watching.